How's it going, everyone? Uh, it's been a while. I haven't been particularly motivated for the last couple of months, so uh, this has sort of taken a back seat. But I got an email uh, a few days ago from a developer who asked me to check out their game, and that's the first time that's ever happened to me, so I figured I should give it a go. Let's get into it. So this is called Recall vs. The World. Uh, it's a puzzle game where you uh, fire guns and your movement is based on the recoil from the gun. So we get in and take a look. Right, pretty simple mechanic. And if you crash into the spikes, obviously you die. So that's as far as I've seen. So let's uh, take a look. Tight squeeze. A new gun. Okay. So this time I've got a shotgun. Okay. And it looks like the recoil's a lot higher. I wonder if... Oh, it's still fired pretty fast. Ooh. A lot of recoil though, so you got to be careful. Easy is always the best. Okay. I'm guessing one of these is going to be a decoy. Yep. Ooh. Did you sit easy was best? I feel lied to. Ooh, this is... That's close. Oh, no. We're gonna have to work with angles with the more powerful guns. Light at the end. Oh, okay. Ooh. This is the type of level where I usually rush things and just end up dying over and over again. Like that. <laughs> Okay, a little bit of patience goes a long way. Lovely. Oh, <laughs> okay. No. Ooh, lucky. Okay, so we don't turn the laser off. Oh, that's tight. Oh, this still is very easy to control. Zooming out. Oh, okay. That's just much more busy. Patience, Nick, patience. Oh, come on. Oh, jeez, come on. I'm very much my own worst enemy with these types of games because I do not have the patience. And it's not like anything's moving, you know, nothing's coming at me. So I could take all the time in the world, but I just don't. Nice. Double laser. Okay, two switches. And the shotgun, so I have to be more careful. I'm trying to cut the corners with the shotgun because usually hmm, you never know if 
too close. Like if I fired it from here, I'd definitely hit the wall. So you got to try and ooh, cut the corners to send the recoil somewhere. Ooh, that's gonna be close. Ooh. Risky maneuver. Could have gone very badly. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's a good thing that doesn't have much recoil. And still, I run out of patience. Okay, I think that is just a glitch, because that's the last level in, in this. This is a demo, by the way, for the full game. Um, and I think that's the last level, but there's a small glitch which isn't letting me finish it. But, um, but whatever. That's, um, that's that game done. Um, I quite like it. Uh, I like recoil as a mechanic. That's quite fun. Um, I think where this game needs to go next is making the levels more dynamic or more reactionary because at the moment it's like i said even though i hit the walls a lot it's very easy to just sit there slowly uh and work out how much room you have and and fire the gun the exact no, right number of times but um if you have something like moving targets or moving obstacles or areas where you're sliding like on ice so you have to fire the gun to move a direction and then fire in the opposite direction to stop yourself stuff like that um i think that's where the real challenge for this kind of movement mechanic comes in um and i'd love to see yeah some more dynamic levels by the way i enjoyed it Thanks for watching and have a good one.